Today we're testing out this vegan seitan pastrami recipe from the Field Rose Cookbook. So let's see if it's worth it. You're gonna need to chop a lot of onions and garlic. Add it to a pan with some soaked sun-dried tomatoes, sauerkraut, vegan bouillon, caraway seeds, bay leaves, olive oil, and saute for 20 minutes till it's nice and brown. Set that aside to cool and then combine vegetable broth, sesame oil, red wine, tomato sauce, and those cooled veggies, along with some soy sauce, and then add that to a bowl with vital wheat gluten and chickpea flour. Knead the dough, shape it into a log, wrap it in cheesecloth, and tie it off with twine. In a big pot, combine some toasted pickling spices with water, apple cider vinegar, sauerkraut brine, salt, peppercorns, bring it to a boil, and simmer your loaf for an hour and a half. Then you're gonna rub it with a spice blend. Here's our finished pastrami. Let's give her a slice. Look at that. It's really good, very salty, but in the way that pastrami is supposed to be. A little sweet too, maybe from all the onions and tomatoes. I really like the texture. I think this would be amazing in a vegan Reuben, so stay tuned for that.